Howdy! I went over to the grocery store and found something very interesting. I am going to be reviewing today the Hostess Ding Dong's Ice Latte. Yeah! Hola gang and welcome back to Old Nerd Reviews. I'm Tony, your Old Nerd of the day and I do try things so you don't have to. Um, yeah, uh, I, I found that they have two. They have a Ding Dongs and they have one for Twinkies. But this is a 13.7 fluid ounce bottle, uh, artificially flavored iced latte. And on the back, uh, the first ingredient is brewed coffee. And then milk, skim milk, sugar, cream, and a whole lot of other crap. So, of course, as you know, I am a coffee fanatic. And I love frappes. Uh, McDonald's is my favorite place to get frappes. And uh, that's, that's the way I roll. All right, so... Ding dong, the witch is dead, witch will witch the wicked witch. As I learned from last time, I got my glass full of ice there. And of course, we're going to shake the crap out of this thing. And pop the lid. You hear a little pop there. It smells chocolatey. And I'm trying to get a ding dong type of smell to it. Yeah, I guess I can. It's been a long time since I've had a hostess ding dong. All right, let's put it in, fill it up. All right, as you can see, it's nice and chocolatey looking and uh, we'll give it a shot. Do it again. Finish it off. Hmm. Interesting. All right. The damage on the Hostess Ding Dong's Iced Latte. Uh, picked it up over at Walmart and it ran me $2.88. A little bit steep. Okay. Let me break it down. Um... It's nice. It's sweet. It's refreshing. Um, makes you know you're drinking a frap. That's for sure. Or frappe. Don't don't hate. And it is different than a regular chocolate frappe would taste. I'm 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 trying to tune in to a, a ding dong's flavor. And I'm not sure I'm getting that exactly. I'm getting something different. Um, it, it, it does remind me of a, a cake flavor, a, a chocolate um, iced cake flavor. Um, but I'm not sure if it's a ding dong flavor. But I like it. On the Nerdometer, I would give that puppet right there. Um, I'm a little torn. I, I think I would give this a middle of the road, I like it. Uh, the reason being that it is good and I do like it. The sweetness, the chocolatey, the, the, the almost a cakey iced flavor. But I'm not sure that it tastes like a ding dong. But this would be really good if I made it up in my blender and turned it into a legit iced frappe. Put a little whipped cream on top and maybe drizzled a little bit of Hershey's chocolate on there. I think it'd be really good. Would I recommend it? Um, if you like frappes, just straight across the board, this is a legit, really nice flavored frappe, but uh, if you're expecting something that tastes exactly like a Hostess Ding Dong, I don't think you're going to be getting that. Something similar 
but not exactly. <coughs> Ooh, there you go. But I want to hear from you guys. If you have tried this, um, let me know if you think this tastes like a legitimate Hostess Ding Dong. And if you've tried the Twinkie one, go ahead and let me know down in the comments. Tell me what you thought about that one too. There you go, gang. Another review in the bag. Thank you so much for just spending some of your time with me. Find all the nerdy groovy links for all my social media, the, the live streams every Friday, down in the description. And if you do all that, you too can become a part of the coffee swilling coffee swilling old nerd crony community uh -huh. all right you guys have a freaking awesome day and i'll talk to you again bye now <laughs>